Number 10 Buffalo City Hall Even while visiting Buffalo City Hall might not be high on most visitors list to things to go, it ought to be. For lovers of historic structures, this outstanding example of art deco architecture is a must see. Built in 1932, the structure stands as a magnificent example of the affluence and influence Buffalo enjoyed at that time. Number 9. Birchfield Penny Art Center This Buffalo landmark houses the largest collection of Charles E. Birchfield's works and is a major cultural attraction in the area. You will also find an excellent collection of local Buffalo or Niagara region artwork in addition to his creations. Number 8. Delaware Park and the Buffalo Zoo With its large open green spaces, tree-lined walking and jogging routes, and tennis and golf options, Delaware Park is a tremendous asset to the city of Buffalo. The Buffalo Zoo is one of the park's primary attractions. A gorilla troop, an Indian rhinoceros, polar bears, tigers, and a myriad of other creatures are among the diverse species found in the zoo. Number 7. Albright Knox Art Gallery The Albright Knox Art Gallery, located in Delaware Park, is built in a magnificent Greek Revival structure and has a sizable collection of modern and contemporary art. Particularly, noteworthy are the works of post-World War II American and European artists including Gorky, Pollock, Warhol and Johns. Number 6. Buffalo and Erie County Naval and Military Park the guided missile cruiser USS Little Rock, destroyer USS The Sullivans, and submarine USS Croker are housed in Buffalo and Erie County Naval and Military Park, which is located alongside the canal in downtown Buffalo next to the revitalized Canalside neighborhood. Number 5. Forest Lawn Cemetery with 250 acres, Forest Lawn is a sizable and beautiful cemetery that dates back to 1849. With its old trees, water features and walking trails, the area has the appearance and feel of a park. The cemetery is very lovely in the autumn. Numerous renowned persons have their last resting place here. Number 4. Pier Arrow Museum Visitors to the distinctive and rather quirky Pier Arrow Museum will likely enjoy learning more about autos and other modes of transportation. The museum bears the name of the original Pier Arrow automobile manufacturer, which once had a factory in Buffalo. Number 3. Buffalo and Erie County Botanical Gardens more than 2,000 plants and trees can be found in the 155-acre South Park, which Olmsted designed in the late 1800s. The focal point of the Buffalo and Erie County Botanical Gardens is the 1894 Victorian-style tri glass conservatory building, which was first inaugurated for the 1900 Pan American Exposition. Number 2. Canal Side Locals and visitors can go to Canal Side, a revitalized part of downtown Buffalo that runs along the canal, to enjoy some green space, unwind, and perhaps take in some entertainment. Number 1 Darwin D. Martin House Darwin D. Martin House, one of Buffalo's must see sites, was created by Frank Lloyd Wright. This house, one of Wright's finest prairie homes and one of his finest works from the first part of his career, is situated in a charming residential neighborhood on the outskirts of Delaware Park.